So this is Dixie and she's ready to go in for a bath. Uh, she is about this size. She's really small. She's not a big dog at all, like I said earlier. Um, she's not always excited for bath time. So you can see her face. She's not really thrilled about this, but you can, you will see that after bath time, she will feel a lot better. She haven't had her bath in about two weeks now. And you can see how her fur is a little bit oily. <laughs> so she, she, you, your dog really have to trust you in order for this process to go well. Now, if she's not, if your dog is not trained to sit still, it will have to take a couple times for your dog to be trained to, uh, to learn how to sit still in a bathtub. So if you're feeling that your dog is not complying the first time, don't give up. Um, you'll be saving tons of money. So please watch on. So we are now going into the bathtub and our door is like this. I don't know, you can get your dog into a regular shower, but it just happened that our bathtub looks like this. It has two doors, it's not very convenient, but I think that your bathtub will be actually more convenient than the one I have. Well, it'll be stepping in here, and if you're used to washing your dog, like the first dog that I had, I washed her in the kitchen sink. I think this is much more efficient. Um, she looks a little scared. But this, trust me, this is not her first time. Okay. Dog can actually feel the water being cold too. And then just gently shower her. I'll let the water run for a while. I even like turn the panel to make it harder like this. Change the water a little. Make sure you turn her around, wash her from behind. Make sure you have all the water. There. She's relaxed. You just have to make sure that she trusts you. Now, when it comes to washing her face, make sure you cover both her ears. So that way water doesn't come into her ears. Okay. See how I'm washing her ear and folding her ears at the same time? Just to be extra careful with that sensitive spot. I'll put the towel around her. So we got the towel. Ready to lift her out. <laughs> there we go. the blow dryer and the brush ready for her see what I'm going to do with this and it will magically be over make sure that the heat is on high um, and hot but don't wave it right where she is
So we are back and um, Dixie is now a one happy little Pomeranian. She's all bathed up. And um, I'm not going to blow dry her to the point where she's very dry because that's when she'll really feel the heat. So she can, she can just run around the house and air dry a little bit. But as you can see, her fur is about 90% dry. So say bye to the camera, Dixie, until next time.